go. Hey everybody, welcome back to Guns and Gadgets, your premier source for Second Amendment news. I am with the man, the myth, the legend, Reed Hendricks, here at Valor Ridge. <laughs> Uh, dude, thank you for having me out hey, here. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Yeah. I really do. Yeah. First off, before we get uh, talking, if you have not come to Valor Ridge, uh, take a class here. Make a trip. He's sold out, like so. You got to really get in the game to get a class, but it's well worth the trip. It's well worth the time. It's extremely, extremely cost effective. Uh, I love what you're doing here, man. I've been following from afar, and I'm finally glad I can, can get down here. So thank you. No, thank you. I appreciate you being here. It, it's been a blessing over like the last. This is around our seventh year now, and. I think like um, it's just been an incredible ride. You know, I've seen your channel go from I remember when you first started, and <laughs> then now it's you know half a million almost. Almost. So you're right there. Almost. Um, appreciate what you're doing for uh, for everything and bringing people news and, uh, and keeping everybody informed. And so information is a good thing, and and people those stories are breaking every single day. Sometimes once, twice, three times every day, and you you're always there bringing the people information. So. Uh, I appreciate that as well. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. It's a testament to my wife. Without her, then none of this happens. So <laughs> I kind of give her those shout outs so she knows I'm thankful. Yeah. Um, so you see a lot of shooters, and I would imagine, and correct me if I'm wrong, you're seeing an influx of new people. Yeah. Uh, if I'm somebody who's watching and thinking, you know, what can I do to, to maybe get involved or make a change or even get training, what, do you, what would you suggest for a, a green person who hasn't done this before? Oh, man, it's, it's a good one. Uh, a person who's just getting into it, you know, first of all, you know, buy something quality. You know, there's a lot of things out there that are being sold and, you know, the price may look attractive, but at the end of the day, you, know, you want to buy a quality firearm. You know, there's a reason why, you know, the good ones keep sticking around. Right. There's, a, there's a reason why uh, you're going to see a pattern of, of, of people that uh, have been doing this for a long time use certain things, and there's a reason why. So I'd invest in a quality firearm. The cheapest one may not always be the best deal. Uh, but then again, you don't have to go with that Gucci expensive stuff either. So, you know, my preferences are, are what they are. Everybody's got their own preference, but I'd say buy something quality. Um, after you do that, guys, you know, first of all, uh, my, my recommendation is, and this, like, once again, this isn't to drum up business. I don't, like, I don't, I don't, like, class already sold out. So I'm, I'm doing this hopefully to save you time and money and frustration. So first thing I would do is invest in a quality class and figure out, you know, do you really need certain things? Uh, we had students in class day with iron sights, right. hitting 300 yards, no problem, yep. uh, you know, the first day. Um, so, you know, you may want to take a class to begin with rather than buying, you know, a really expensive optic or a really expensive light or a really expensive couple of guns. You know, you may want to go take a class and, and see how that goes. I know you've been in the game uh, for over 20 years now. Yep. Yep. Um, you've done the door kicker stuff. You've done the, the, the regular LE stuff. You've done that. And uh, you've seen the evolution of things happen, but uh, you know from your own experience, you also see what works. So um, I would recommend a good quality firearm to begin with, and then take a class, get in there, and see um, what it takes to. Maybe you may need something, you may not need something, and in the end, you may look at it and say, "Oh, it's like five, six hundred bucks." But at the end of the day, you know, think about what a brand new gun costs. Right. Think about what a brand new sight costs, and right. and then you may find yourself saving yourself some money and, and also some frustration. One thing I will say is, somebody who's taken classes all around the country, um, take as many as you can. Don't think you take one class and you're done and you know it all. Uh, it's always, uh, as you said, it's an evolution. What you learn in one class, you might pick up something different from another an instructor. And uh, try to go to every class with an open mind. Like, don't show up thinking, I know more than more than these people. Uh, so that's that's the big thing for me. Always always have an open mind because uh, you know I learned things from Reed's style today that I didn't pick up from other instructors. So if I can learn something new, I'm sure you guys and gals can too. Yeah. Um, so just give folks uh, an idea, like how can they find you? What's the website and all that stuff? Um, you can go to valorridge.com. Um, we you know we're out there and our schedule for this year, like I said, we just we don't have a whole lot of classes left that we can sell. I'm not going to teach more and. Quite honestly, next year I'm probably going to end up teaching significantly less. And it's not that I don't enjoy teaching. It's just that, uh, you know, this is our seventh year. Next year will be our eighth year. Um, I'm at every class, you know. I'm here every time. i got great guys that help out. Um, but I think that uh, go out valorich.com, find us there. Uh, my YouTube channel is Reed Hendricks, you know. Uh, we're out there. I do try to do a video every week. It doesn't always happen. <laughs> Maybe every other week sometimes. But, um, yeah, that's how you can find us. I'll tell you, and I didn't, I haven't told this to you yet, but when I, my channel was minuscule, this was one of the, the big guys that I watched. Um, 
I've always found him to be honest, truthful, and very constitutional. And for those who know me, I try to walk that line as well. Um, so thank you for inspiring people like me to do what we do, because uh, I probably wouldn't be doing it without people like you. So thank uh, you. Means a lot. Means a lot. And uh, it's good to know there's good guys out there. You know, I mean, obviously. Uh, having done the profession that you've done for 24 plus years now it's not always an easy day with that you take that constitutionally minded mindset into the le role and now it's in the news role so it's kind of cool to see that evolution and uh i think it's a good thing you know there's there's it's a really good thing to have guys out there that uh that are constitutionally minded I, it's it's pretty much a for me it's a non-compromising thing because if you give somebody an inch they'll definitely keep trying to take more and more and more and uh, compromise generally means that you know you get something, the other side gets something. I just I don't see what we as as firearms owners and Second Amendment advocates. I don't see what we have gotten since 1934. Right. Like we haven't gotten anything in return. All we have done is cede rights, and and I think that 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 moment for ceding any further rights is over. Right. And I think people need to start understanding that process and what that mentality is. And it's not only time to not budge one more single iota. But I think it's also time to dig in those feet and push that sled in the opposite direction. And that's kind of what I've been advocating for in my local community, in my state, um, in other ways. And I know you have, too. Try. I mean, we're not quite as cool as Tennessee, but um, we're, we're trying. We're trying. Uh, but, brother, thank you again uh, for being somebody that those of us who are starting out can look up to and, and, and aspire to be like. Uh, it really it was an honor for me to be here today, to meet you. I'm glad to have you, and it's a wonderful uh, blessing to be able to do what we do. I'm grateful for guys out there like you that keep spreading the word and uh, and keep pushing. I think you'll get a million subs in no time. So We'll see. Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, if you're interested, check out ValorRidge.com. Check out Reed Hendricks on uh, YouTube. And if you can't get to a class right away, he has a lot of cool videos out there, so you can start there as well. Um, and uh, check out that view. That's That's freedom right there. None of that in Boston. All right, guys, until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, and carry a weapon. Take care, everybody. Thank you.